Well, he's been bitten more times than I can count, but assures me there's nothing to worry about here. All right, Corbin Maxey has been spending time with us all morning long with his friends Ooh. from the continent of Asia. And Corbin, yes. you know I don't like snakes, and you bring out even more. I brought so out more. We already met Buddy. I told you, Asia is home of the giants. Yeah, yeah, I'm getting that. And uh, <laughs> I know we brought out the largest snakes in the world here today. This is actually Shere Khan, and he is an albino Burmese python. Now, remember, we, Buddy, we, we kept Buddy up here to show folks at home the uh, difference, like the whole like pattern mm -hmm. difference and stuff like that. And take a look. I mean, they still have the same patterns, of course, but Shere Khan obviously Albino. is, uh, is yeah. he's actually taking off. Uh, yeah, no, he he's is. He's actually uh, lacking that color pigment. Now, a lot of people, do you get Nate? Come yeah, on, yeah, all right. Fine. Okay. Um, yeah, a lot of people ask, they say, well, are albinos found in the wild? Mm -hmm. They must be rare. And believe it or not, albinos, they are found in the wild. Yeah. Um, you can just relax. It's fine. You're just, okay. Uh. <laughs> I'll just hold them up. I'll just hold it. Yeah, I wasn't no, squeezed them okay, or anything. No, nothing like that. Uh, no, no, no. But a lot of people ask me, say, you know, do you find them out in the wild? And you actually, they are hatched out in the wild, but unfortunately, um, they're picked up right away because they lack that camouflage. Yeah. They get picked up by, like, birds of prey, yeah. mammals, but mainly birds, of course. And so um, you wouldn't find one of these albinos in the wild, but in captivity, yes, you probably, you know, probably would find Buddy, it. that's a no-fly zone, my friend. Yeah. <laughs> um, and these are both rescues, of course, we learned Buddy was rescued from a fire. And Sher Khan, unfortunately, um, his owners got in some trouble, and uh, they abandoned this snake. They had to move out. They abandoned this huge snake in their He's apartment big. Very for a big. month without food or water. Isn't that amazing? And it's so sad how people treat these animals. And um, I can't even go for that it. long without food or water. Yeah, yeah. and That's... they can actually survive. Um, that's my New York accent. Yeah, coming through. Sorry, <laughs> sorry. Um, uh, anyway, no, but they can actually uh, go without food for over a year. But that's not something you want to do. That's only Absolutely if you know. Yeah. I mean, but in the wild, of course, Animal sometimes cruelty it happens. Right, you can't do that. Um, but uh, yeah, and so of course we rescued Shere Khan. Now, of course, he's. This um, is the great part about live well, television. These guys have a mind of their own, <laughs> they and they're going to prove it. They're they going to prove it. And Shere Khan has shared his story with literally millions of people. Of course, the millions that watch this show, and the millions <laughs> that watch Jay Leno, and of course the millions that watch Martha Stewart. And uh, on Martha Stewart, he was on Martha Stewart. How did she respond? She she loved it. She's really? like, oh, come here. She doesn't talk like that, does she? Um, I'm so bad with impersonations, but she's great with animals. She absolutely loved the animals. And wow. uh, yeah, she was really good in Shere Khan. She's a cool it? customer. I could see that. Yeah. Not a lot shakes, Martha. <laughs> no, no, no. She's so used to it. And of course, she's been everywhere. So right, <laughs> she, right. I've been to Asia and seen these, you know, before. But anyway, uh, um, we love Martha. Um, but uh, Sher Khan's great, and I, we feel so fortunate to be able to share his story with all their viewers. You know? Well, again, Corbin, if folks oh. are interested and want to find out more, mm -hmm. yes, wrapping right around, they're lovers. Yeah. Uh, if folks want to find out more about your animals, you have your own show, tell us about that yes, again. Yes, Live with the Reptile Guy. Tune in. We're on season two, and I, I've gosh, I've been so fortunate here. You got renewed. Know, I got renewed for, and it was so hard to have us renew. No, <laughs> we have studio audiences now. We have new guests, and I, I, it's so exciting to you know be able to like build a show and stuff like that. And of course, it airs Mondays at 11:30 in the morning, and uh, Saturdays at 9:30, um, stuff like that. We also have my blog mm -hmm. and yeah, Twitter. Yeah, tell me about it, finding you on cyberspace. Where all can we see oh you? Oh my online? gosh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, you know, I'm gonna start doing vlogs too, video logs. Really? Isn't that amazing? Branch all the place Tech, I am. Yeah. technology and animals yeah like um, we're on facebook we're on myspace um we uh, of course uh we're on twitter we love twitter now Isn't loving that weird? the twitter remember i didn't like it when i first started but i now that. i'm like tweeting backstage you know what i mean like <laughs> secretly like trying to get my tweets up but anyway yeah we've gotten more uh Twitter followers, which is yeah. great. Thanks, folks. For I've been uh, and I've us. been twittering how much uh, I'm scared of these things, but I'm doing pretty good right now. You're I'm able to really touch good. them. It's all right. I'm yeah, conquering the fear. Look at him. He's coming over to you. How often do you run into people that are, are fearful of snakes? Oh and my really gosh! Need help with all it? the time, and I try to cure it. Of course, you know, doing our shows. Yeah. We, ranch out and um, you know try to reach as many people and show them that snakes aren't really bad at all and yeah. you know what's crazy a lot of people are more scared of the tiny tiny little snakes yeah. than the big snakes yeah these move slower um, well Corbin we'll yes. have one more opportunity to hang with you oh, uh, just a little bit here Folks, before we back. end the show this the morning oh, and hello oh. there buddy <laughs>